Breaking news now. Just a few hours ago, the Supreme Court decision on what map will be used to determine who might represent you in Congress. Capitol correspondent Chris Rosado is with us in the studio to walk us through what this means for you, Chris. Yeah, well, guys, the nation's highest court has sided with the attorney general and voting rights advocates by granting the stay that was filed last week, meaning Louisiana will be allowed to use the map the legislature recently passed that included two majority black districts. So the attorney general issued a statement moments after saying we will continue to defend the law and are grateful the Supreme Court granted the stay, which will ensure to have a stable election season. The Secretary of State's office had asked for a decision to be made by today in order to have things properly lined up ahead of the election. This means Congressman Gary Graves, who currently represents District 6, will have a new pool of voters he'll have to win over. While at the same time, Democrat State Senator Cleo Fields plans to challenge him come November. So we're still waiting for a reaction from Congressman Gary Graves' office as well as a few others. But as soon as we get those, we'll have those for you all. Guys, back to you. All right, Chris, many thanks.